Uh, so we're looking at SOLIDWORKS. We have a small cabinet model here um, on the, you know, a couple of ends, a couple of drawer fronts. On the right side, we've added in this little, or little really, it's a pretty big circle here, um, just kind of a pocket. Uh, something out of the ordinary so we can see that it, it's really loading these shapes in, uh, these parts here. So um, now that, you know, we just want to export this. So this is actually a pretty quick process. Uh, you have the Cobus in CAD export plugin here at the top in your ribbon and it really looks and feels and works just the same as uh, any of the inbuilt um, you know f functionality inbuilt tools that, that SolidWorks has so um, we have certain configurations here but it should actually be set up the way that I want and I just have to hit OK and you can see it's now processing through uh, all those parts and this just takes it a minute while it you know identifies all the different uh, assemblies, uh, the parts in that assembly, and determines the shapes and all the machinings. Okay, so that's done now. It's now loading up NCAD, Copus NCAD. And the first thing we're actually going to see is a dialog screen that will show all the parts that it imported. So here's that dialog. We can see, you know, it's brought in a number of parts here. I'm not sure how many exactly are in the model, but we have uh, several here. And let's see if we can find, so there's some of those drawer fronts that we have uh, over there on the, on the right side. Some more of those. Uh, here's the, the end. And I believe we'll have another right end with that, that shape in it uh, that I was I mentioned before, that big circular pocket. And let's load this guy into NCAD. And this is where we can now uh, do the processing. So let me actually minimize my screen so we can see this. And let me bring this in here. So now we should be able to see the full NCAD screen. Uh, on the left is all of the, the the cam information that it brought in. On the right is the preview. We can now run a simulation. And let me bring this in here. So, so this this we have done no cam um, you know cam work on the side, setting machining, so selecting tools, diameters. It's imported this straight from the SolidWorks model, and you can see here. It's now running through some of these drills, um, doing the boring, but we can also have, let's see what this one does. So this is doing the, the perimeter cut, doing the trim. Uh, some of these other ones are probably going to be doing this pocket here, so kind of doing an inside out milling. And now, piece by piece, we can send this out to whichever machines we want to send it to. So here in this particular version, that uh, the plugin is connected to. We have a BSA, a Wiki, and an EMA machine. And depending on which one we want to send it to, we just set that machine to active. So we're using the BSA right now, so we're going to get a, a CIX file, and we generate that CIX file. And this is what our code is going to look like. So here's the actual code. And that should should really be it you know sometimes not too much to show on the plugin because that's the whole point of it is supposed to be short and sweet so that there isn't a lot of manual editing done it should import directly from SolidWorks from this model into into NCAD